fellow Sudokans, and welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. Uh, it's Tuesday the 20th of December 2022. Oh, we're not that far away from Christmas, are we? Uh, for those of you that have Christmas here in Bangkok, we don't really have that thing. Uh, not, Well, I certainly don't anyway. Um, some people do, I guess, in their homes. Uh, but it's not a public holiday or anything like that. It's just the 25th of December here. Although, actually, this year I believe it's on a Sunday, isn't it? So I guess it will be a holiday after all. Uh, right, this is the uh, New York Times medium level game. Now, this is if those of you haven't experienced this challenge before, it can be quite a nice game, to be honest with you. It's often quite well thought out or... Or maybe it's just per, per chance that the computer algorithm happens to work out nice puzzles on this sometimes. But um, anyway, it's quite an enjoyable game to play. In the meantime, back in the UK, I see the nurses are on strike again. And the Tories are doing their usual tough guy type of nonsense. Even though, of course, they're willing to spend billions and billions uh, wasting on friends and corruption in the UK. Uh, connected with health service. Um, they're not willing to pay a decent wage to the nurses or other staff involved. So anyway, life goes on back there. Let's uh, not worry too much about that for me because I'm here in sunny Bangkok. Well, it's not sunny right now because it's night time, evening time. This is my game of Sudoku at bedtime. And as I say, I've chosen the uh, New York Times medium level today. So let's get on with it. Let's start at the very beginning. That's a very good place to start. We have ones, com C, and uh, let's place our digit one there. Um, anything else looking good? Yeah, there's a nice easy eight to grab over here. People will be saying, but you didn't check out the ones. No, I didn't, but I just happened to see the eights nice and simply. They jump up at me. If numbers jump up at me, what am I supposed to do? I'm helpless against their um, pining of get me, get me. So seven's blocking down here. Here's a seven. And another seven up here looking nice and easy to grab hold of. So we'll do that one as well before we start looking seriously at other possibilities. Anything, I always like to grab anything that's easy to do at the beginning. Uh, we have threes blocking up here like this with a three across. So that will give us a three in that square. Right, okay, so I'm not seeing, nothing else is jumping up at me. Oh, something is jumping up at me now, a New York Times uh, hard level type thing. Look, five, six, and eight blocking up here. So we get five, six, and eight in those three squares there. Five, six, and eight blocking these two squares here, right? And getting, so that leaves us with three possibilities. So five, six, and eight here. We cannot actually say which is which but we do know that it's five six and eight so that means that in these two squares we are looking for one and two only so that means that two then blocks all the way down here two blocks down here and two blocks across here so that will give us a two in that square there and then we can take that two and say across here two across here that will give me a two like that and what was the other thing i said a one here in this in this these two squares so it's going to put one into those squares we have ones now ah we have one blocking excuse me we have one blocking here one blocking here and one blocking here so that is one and not only that now that we have ones like this, we know that one has to be in either this square or this square. So we know that that can't be a one. So of our one and two in these two squares, 
that's the location of one that's the position for two so also going to put twos like this which might be good down here now we have six blocking across here so we can place our six there we have four blocking down here and four across here so here's the location of four four oh yeah I thought for a second there I I'd messed it up but no seems to be okay that's where the four goes isn't it up here we have four across here across here and up here so that's the four, four down here, across here, up here. Four goes there. We need one more four. So it looks like that's the sweet spot for it. Okay, four across here, down. Yes, it was indeed. I'll highlight them for you just because, um, you know, people watching this video um, might be quite new to Sudoku, some people. And so uh, it's useful for me to highlight these things. I mean, sometimes I don't need to because I can see where they go without the highlighting, but it's useful. I usually do it during these videos just to show um, newcomers uh, how to kind of um, see where the things are going. That I'm trying to point out. Um, okay, quite a few threes. Yeah. Not doable. Okay, seven across here and seven down here puts a seven into that square there. Um, sorry for the quick silence there. I'm just trying to work out these things. If you are new to the channel, you should know that I don't play any of these games ahead of time. I just set the camera rolling and try my best. Sometimes they go well, sometimes they don't go so well. <laughs> That's part of it. It's just, uh, just wondering how on earth it's going to go um, for me. Ah, okay. We've got eights blocking up like this. So here's an eight. Uh, now, I had something before along here, didn't I? Up and, okay, yeah, so it's one and eight. So look, the one and one and eight block across this row, one and eight block up this column. So that's going to leave us with a pair of one and eight in those two squares there. Uh, which means that 8 is going to be down here like this. 5 and 6, we don't know. Okay. 8. Um, right, sorry about that. Let me come back here. 1 and 8. What else do we know? Six
Um, uh, how about if I check these out? Uh, so if that's one and eight. We are looking for ah yeah, of course. So uh, this is one and eight, right? Oh no, 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 no! Forget that. <laughs> I thought I'd seen something again. Have not seen one. Five, five, six, nine. Nope. No, I didn't discover anything. Okay, let's see if I'm missing anything uh, obvious, which sometimes happens. Um, okay, ones are still like that. Twos are in those squares in these squares in these squares here still possible like that I guess Trees look like that. <coughs> Excuse me. Fives. Hmm. That's the only five on the board, actually. So, yeah, five is still pretty tough. Six is rather sketchy. I set eights up here. Ah, okay, gotcha. All right, so uh, because I put one and eight into these two squares, that puts eight down here, right? You agree because the eight blocking across here like this. So eight has to be in one of these two squares here. We've got eight blocking across here. That puts eight into one of these two squares. So that cannot be eight. Eight must be in that square. And we'll be left with a pair of five and six up here now, but still can't get those. Still work to be done here. Uh, but we do have eights in those squares there. I'm not sure how this helps, but I do notice the nines blocking up here, which puts nines into one of these squares. So let's see with the nines. Oh, I was, I have, I'm going through digit by digit. I haven't checked the nines yet anyway, so I guess that is in fact my next job. And then over here, still three squares possible. Hmm.
Ah, uh, so two, three blocking down here and two, three blocking across here gives me a pair of two and three in those squares there now. So knowing that that's two and three, let's hope it's going to lead to some other discovery. Uh, right, one, two, three, four. So how about the fives? What do we know? Anything useful? Not really. Three possibilities on five. Uh, six must be in this row, but I knew that or column here, but I knew that already, so that's not a new discovery. Seven, seven is down here, and I think I knew that already, so that's not a new discovery. Uh, and what's the other thing? Nine, nine is down here, so. It's not new either. Six, Oh, seven. This is six, nine, seven in these three squares, isn't it? We've got six blocking this square. We've got seven blocking this square. This is two, three, right? Six, seven. Oh, let's work this out. Sixes block up here and six blocks down here. So six is there. Seven blocks here. This is two and three, so seven is there. And nine blocks up here, so nine is in those squares blocking down here. So this is six, seven, nine. Okay, and this is two and three. And so this is six, seven, nine. This is two and three. This has to be five. Phew, just about got there. Right, and we will be left in these squares with six and nine, I believe. And this would be sevens down here, six, nine, six, nine, yes, I think so. Oh, I hope I've done that right. Uh, now, let's see, back up here. So we've got fives blocking down he up here, which puts fives into one of these two squares blocking down here. So here we'll go the five then. And what else did we say? This is two, three, wasn't it? three and seven okay so seven blocking down here here's the seven here's the three three blocking here here's the three and this is the two of course from our two three that we had in those squares two blocking up here two across here here is our two at this column now we are looking for a nine let's put the nine in Nine across these two rows, that gives us a nine in this square here. Uh, whatever we're left with, this has got to be the same as that, which has got to be the same as that, but I can't work it out yet. What is it? Five, six, isn't it? Five, six. Yeah. So five, six here, five, six here, anything? No. Five, six here, anything? No. All right. Well, we had a look anyway. Um, where to now? I wonder if it might be beneficial just to click on the digits one more time as though I'm singing a song. Certainly will. We've got two across here and two up here. That's going to give me a two there, two down here, two up here, two across here. That's the final two. Let's move on to three. No, can't do anything because we've got threes like that. Fives. Yep, 
Yes, we have 5 blocking this square here, so that must be a 5. And so this cannot be a 5, and this must be a 5, and this cannot be a 5, this must be a 5. The last number to place here then is a 6, and we will need a 6 up here, and 6 blocking across here puts a 6 into that square there. 6 down here, 6 across these two rows gives me a 6 down here. 6 up here, 6 down here, there's a 6. And one number to get across here, which is a 9, I think. All right. Okay, what's left to get across up here? It's 1 and it's 8. Do we have any 1s or 8s? No, not yet. Oh, I hear cats making strange noises outside. I don't think it's mine, though. Mm, that doesn't sound good. Oh, they're about to fight. Excuse me, one second. Okay, I've just discovered it's not my cat. My cat is curled up asleep on the sofa in his rightful place, being king of the manor. And so um, I can just ignore those uh, about to fight, those cats that are about to fight. Um, now, let's get back on to the game of Sudoku. I lost my thread just a bit there. Where am I? Sudokus Interruptus, I think that is a case of. Um, hmm. What's missing from here? Um, mm -mm, six and seven. We've got sixes here. What else do we have here? We've got sevens over here. Oh, one, that's it, six and one. Okay, we've got one, six, excuse me, one, six, one, six, like that. So we've got a pair of one and six here. Uh, and this is seven. Oh, nine, there we go, nine blocking down here. That's the nine, isn't it? And then nine blocking down here and down here and across here like that. So that's a nine. And I'm going to get the eight here because I remember we had eights in those two squares before. So that's our eight, eight blocking across like this. That gives us an eight here, eight blocking that square. That will be our eight. The last number here to get is one. Um, one number down here, five, I believe. Five then blocking up here puts a five into that square there. The last number missing here is a 9. Oh, this game's excited me rather too much for a bedtime game, really. It's, uh, I've rather enjoyed it. It's kept me awake. Um, uh, hopefully I'll be able to uh, um, um, calm down and sleep. 3 across and 3 down here, so that's a 3 in that square. And we've got one more number to fill up this row, and that missing number is a 5. Uh, where else? Oh, five is done now. So there's one number missing here, and that appears to be a seven, I think. Seven blocking across here, so here is the seven, the final digit seven. Here we're looking for a six, let's put that in. Six blocking across, so six in that square. One is the last number here, one blocking back here. Here's a one. Last number for the New York Times medium level game, nine. Uh, so an enjoyable game, that. I like that. Um, like I say, it's rather kept my brain uh, rather too uh, aroused to go to sleep. But never mind, a cup of cocoa or something like that might be might do the trick. Anyway, I'll see you tomorrow uh, in and around work. Bye bye.